of you on your driveway with a big chunky piece of pink chalk. I expose my feelings for you and everybody else to see, but I know you'll never see it. You make it a policy to never look down. You're always reaching for the sky, face up, shoulders back, back straight. You're unafraid, unlike me. Me being gay was something that never really crossed your mind out of a let's avoid the issue kind of way, but because you had better shit to worry about, like the Beatles avoiding meat, the Beatles paying your rent, shade, sleep, the Beatles. Yeah. So the fact that I like girls is as common to you as the fact that I like cherry ice cream, which makes me think I don't think you've thought about it very often. <laughs> and you never put yourself in the category of girls I might like, so every time you try to guess, and you never really got it right, the more I fell in love with you. And the more there were days when I wished I was born a guy, because being in love with someone isn't easy, and being gay just makes it harder. I don't want to disgust you. I don't want your eyes to fill up with the same inhuman look I once saw on my grandmother's face. The first time we saw a gay couple at the park, two women drowning in the love of each other's warmth, I didn't understand what was wrong back then. I still kind of don't today. <laughs> I just want you to love me. Just like those necklaces I see you hang on nails on your bedroom walls, just to make it that much easier to admire them all at once. I just want to be able to hold you. No, maybe not in the way you thought Jack held Rose in that movie Titanic so romantically. <laughs> but I wanted to be next to you. Our bodies huddled against each other like the last two eggs in the cart and awaiting the frying pan. <laughs> I wanted to be able to hold you on rainy days. Days when I feel Days when I feel like taking that cheap piece of pink chalk that I stole from the dollar store to the dusty slab of concrete in front of your apartment window when every raindrop reminds me of you, drip your lips that tasted like cherry vodka the first time we kissed, drip your hair that smells like the sun, drip your low voice that you hate and I love <laughs> drip, drip, drip until the rain is falling too hard I'm no longer here but in the moments of you, me we, us. <laughs> I wanted to find comfort in the, I wanted to find comfort in the us that one person could never truly love alone. But I know us will never happen. Because being best friends forever is always better than not being best friends at all. So this morning, in those three simple words repeated over and over on your driveway, I wrote every need every frustration, every feeling of disgust for the rain to wash away. And I know you'll never see it because all that's left is a puddle on your driveway and the pink dust of chalk on my fingertips. Yeah!